New research led by geneticists from the Queensland University of Technology in Australia has found that depression and endometriosis often coincide, along with a variety of gastrointestinal conditions. The researchers compared data from genetic databases looking for shared genetic risk factors for depression and endometriosis and found 20 independent locations on the genome that were significant to both conditions, eight of which are new. While studies indicate the condition affects roughly 1 in 10 women, people with endometriosis go an average of six and a half years before they get a diagnosis, according to Endometriosis Australia. The mucus that lines the inside of the uterus, called the endometrium, normally thickens and sheds in accordance with a woman's monthly cycle. But those with endometriosis, the lining grows outside the uterus. It still thickens and sheds, but cannot exit the body, leading to irritation and inflammation. Adhesions can often form in the pelvic area, and blood-filled chocolate cysts sometimes develop in the ovaries. The condition has no known cure, but patients can seek treatment to help ease their symptoms. Endometriosis can cause severe pain and is usually treated with painkillers, hormone therapy, or surgery.